In this video, we'll cover printing your completed work orders in bulk. So click the drop down arrow to the right of new work order and pick the completed. You'll see a pop up box that you'll be able to pick what technician and for what time frame you would like to pick. Now, this again will only print completed work orders. So pick the month and then generate the archive file. It will either pop it open in your web browser if the file is of a manageable size. If it's a pretty large file, it'll email you that archive file. The second way to print bulk print completed work orders is pick a time frame. So I'm going to go back to the beginning of 2016. So the first way I did show you was one month at a time, one route at a time. At this level, I can pick an entire time frame, let's say a year or more. I also can then isolate a specific customer. So we'll say Chris Kringle filter. Now regardless of my tech that completed this service location or customers jobs, I have four pages of, of jobs. Now from here I can also then uh, pick a route, filter that down, and click the select all and print all of this particular customer's work orders from that page, so all of their completed work. So the two ways that I can, again, print completed jobs are by using the filters on the left under the sales work orders page and then using this select all and it's a bulk action print completed or by using this drop down menu and completed tickets by route time frame and generate an archive file